hurt, man. So look. Oh. Hey, Kanye West and freaking Candace Owens just started a just started a riot. They just started something. Okay, they just started something. I seen this last night. And I actually posted it right now. It is 1051. So I got a poll at like 11 and asking y'all what y'all think about the situation. Because I seen this last night and I was like, bro, I got I to gotta react to this. Okay. It was like 12 o'clock when I seen this. But dog, Kanye West and Candace Owens wore a shirt. And I, on the back of it, it said White Lives Matter. Now, me, I'm all for it. I'm all for it. I posted on my Instagram and said, um, I, I forgot what I said. I said, like, I love it. Uh, you, I love to see it. And I put, like, quote, quote, uh, like, quote uh, all lives matter. But anyways, that's not the point. So, look, right here on the screen, um, we have social media reacts to Kanye West's White Lives Matter shirt. But they forgot to put Kansas Owens in there. But it was Kansas Owens, too. But, look, if we just go, and it's crazy because black people are going crazy right now over this whole situation. Seriously. This whole situation, they're going crazy. But it's okay for it's okay for the Black Lives Matter. You know what I'm saying? It's okay to where Black Lives Matter, you know. Ain't nobody talking about that. That's okay. That's that's perfectly fine. But when you put White Lives Matter on it, oh, oh, all oh, hell break loose. So look, it's a um Kanye West's decision to wear a White Lives Matter shirt is disgusting, dangerous, and irresponsible. What? What? Mark Lamont Hill, a black man. Why? Why? Why is it? Why is it disgusting? Why is it dangerous? Why is it dangerous? Why? Why is it dangerous to wear a white last my shirt? Why? 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 Why is it dangerous? At least he wore a white last my shirt on a black t-shirt. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Hey, at least he wore. If you want to really get deep with it, technically he sent Black Lives Matter too because it's on a black shirt. I mean, we can get deep with it. I'm just saying. I'm just saying, but why is it disgusting? Why is it dangerous? Why is it irresponsible? Some of y'all will rush to defend him. You should ask yourselves why. Because, I mean, y'all put Black Lives Matter on a shirt. We got Black Lives Matter on t-shirts, sweaters, hoodies, hats, everywhere. Black Lives Matter was a big organization. Organization, We got that on everything. Oh, but it's a White Lives Matter, y'all. That's why it's a big problem. It should not say White Lives Matter. It should definitely say just Black Lives Matter. Because black people, they, they run the world. They are this, they are that. Black black people, they're, they're so powerful. They're so strong that we should have our own organization. Black people, even though they kill each other, it's all good. Because we still matter. We matter. Even though they, even though uh, in, the, in the black communities, they always blaming a white man for this and a white man for that. And they never blame themselves and they never hold themselves responsible. But it's okay. It's all good because Black Lives Matter still matters. Or Black Lives still matters. It, it's okay. <laughs> anyway, so look. The next one. So right here, Kevin Gay said it best. FBLM. Which if y'all didn't go, if y'all didn't watch that uh, that video, y'all should definitely go watch it because what Kevin Gates said was some powerful stuff, and he probably got canceled for it by a lot of black people because black people can never accept the truth. See, black people they listen to what sounds good. They listen, but you gotta realize that what sounds good ain't always good. You feel me? You gotta listen to something that may have a little criticism in there, but if you don't take that criticism, you just consider a fool because that crit that criticism that uh, black people get all the time. You know, even white people, all that criticism, we should all take that in and it should make us more wise. We should realize the things that we do in our life that affects that affects the uh, the way that we live. So when Kevin Gates said this, he got canceled by a lot of black people because they couldn't accept the facts. They couldn't accept the truth. You know what I'm saying? They couldn't accept the truth. But if he said Black Lives Matter, I'm all for my black people, black people with this and black people with that. But they would have they would have definitely listened to what he had to say then. But since he said FBLM, you know what I'm saying? And he was for the whole all lives thing. Every everybody everybody has something to say. Now, right here, uh, at this point, if you are mad over Kanye over Kanye's T-shirt, you aren't thinking logically. You're in your feelings. There are more important things to be mad about, and it ain't a T-shirt. Facts, facts. People so mad about a T-shirt, but it's a T-shirt. Who cares? Who cares? It's a T-shirt. It's seriously a t-shirt. Y'all so mad because of what it say on the t-shirt. It's not just the t-shirt. Y'all mad because of the words that it say on the t-shirt. Why y'all so mad now, but y'all wasn't mad when they put Black Lives Matter on the t-shirt? Y'all wasn't mad then, but y'all mad now. <laughs> this world is funny, bro. 
So many folks are trying to excuse Kanye wearing a White Lives Matter t-shirt as just a troll move or marketing. Maybe it is, but it's a dangerously dumb message, dangerously dumb message to send for someone with this massive platform. I've been off dude, but y'all go ahead labeling his foolishness as genius. <laughs> oh my gosh, bro. It's so dangerous to wear a White Lives Matter t-shirt. Why is it dangerous? Why is it dangerous when you put white on it? Why? Why? Why is it dangerous? Why is it dangerous when I put All Lives Matter? Why is it dangerous? <laughs> bro, I, 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 truly, I truly don't understand. I just don't understand people's logic, okay? Kanye West, Kanye West is a... He, he has his problems. He's not perfect. We all have problems. You, you watching this video, you're not perfect. You know you're not perfect. You got your problems too. But one thing I can say about Kanye is that he never cared. He never cared what people had to say. He don't care. He truly don't care because if he truly did care, he wouldn't wear a White Lives Matter t-shirt. But we're not only talking about Kanye. Candace Owens is a GOAT. She been all about this. You know what I'm saying? She's a freaking GOAT. She's a legend. You know what I'm saying? This woman is a queen. These are the type of women that anybody that anybody should be looking for. The quality that Candace Owens have is the type of qualities you should be looking for in a wife. Or even just if you want to date. You should be looking for these type of qualities. Because Candace Owens is a freaking queen, bro. She knows what she's talking about. You know what I'm saying? She don't, she don't bull, she don't bull crap you. She don't beat around the bush. She gets straight to the point. That's why I love Candace Owens. When I first when I thought about it, when I first started to get political and things like that, when I first when I thought about Candace, bro, I love that woman. I truly love that woman. So we 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 not even talking about Kanye too. We talking about Candace Owens too. But I guess Kanye he just more bigger than uh, Candace. So I guess you know everybody's so much focused on Kanye. But bro, it shouldn't be dangerous to wear a white lives matter shirt. It shouldn't be dangerous to say white people lives matter too. It shouldn't be dangerous to say them type of things, especially in America, when we claim freedom, when we claim that we have freedom of speech. That's not hate speech at all. Saying another person lives matter. That's not hate speech at all. Next slide. Kanye West making black models wear White Lives Matter shirts is a culmination of his anti-black... His anti-blackness? His anti-blackness? What? What? What do y'all mean by his anti-blackness? What, the man just black on the outside but not black on the inside? Like, what, what is y'all talking about? You know what I'm saying? What is y'all talking about? Y'all make race... Bro, y'all put race on everything. And his immersion in... His immersion in white supremacy ideologies and methods, disgusting. <laughs> Bro, you black people are crazy. I swear, you guys are crazy. Y'all so much of a hypocrite. Y'all so hip. Y'all so hypocritical. Why y'all gotta be so, so, so much of hypocrites, bro? Stop being a hypocrite. Seriously. Because months ago, when this whole Black Lives Matter thing was going on, even though it's still going on today, but it's not as it's it's not as like you know you don't see a lot of Black Lives Matter movements on the streets and all that no more like that. But like back in what 2020, 2021, I believe around that time where it was like popping, where y'all was rioting and doing things like that, that wasn't disgusting. That wasn't that wasn't showing disrespect. Was that not? But since Kanye. Put white lives matter on his shirt. That's showing. That's disgusting. That that is that is anti-blackness. That is freaking uh disturbing. That is rude. <laughs> like bro, they just they just put everything on. It's just ridiculous, bro. Seriously, just ridiculous. Kanye West was on Instagram not too long ago talking about the Kardashians were corrupting his black children just to be wearing a white lives matter shirt. Oh my lord. That's one thing I could say that I don't like about Kanye or just the Kardashians or just them period is that you know I don't I don't I don't like when like bigger people, you know what I'm saying? They got a bigger audience, they do all you know, whatever. But I just don't like when they put their freaking uh relationship on the internet. I feel like everybody, if you're big, if you're famous, whatever, keep your relationship personal. Keep it off the internet. You know what I'm saying? Because the more you and that woman break up. The more y'all get into arguments and take it to the internet, now y'all got the whole world in y'all business. And you got to realize the Kardashians, they big within themselves. They're, they're big too. They got a big following. Kanye West, 
big following. But we're not talking about their relationship life. Like I said, they're not perfect. They got their issues. Kanye ending his fashion show with Ma with Malcolm Moore after sending a White Lives Matter t-shirt down the runway is insanity. Insanity. <laughs> Oh, man, these people. What if Kanye is starting a Why Lives Matter organization to steal millions of dollars from white people and buy luxury real estate? First of all, first, first, first of all, do you really think that this man, Kanye West, let's see his, I actually just want to, let's see his, uh, his network, uh, Kanye, Kanye net worth. Two billion dollars. Do you really, did you really, bro, before you make a little tweet, make sure you think, make sure you think about it before you make a little tweet. Do you really think that this man, Kanye, is going to start a white lives matter organization to steal millions of dollars when this man is worth $2 billion? You got to realize that the black people that start the black lives matter organization, they not worth nothing. They wasn't worth nothing. They didn't have no money. So, of course, they did that to steal millions of dollars from black people. Because, you know, black people, they just, oh, oh, yes, we all matter. Ooh, ooh. They just so, they so eager to get it. You know what I'm saying? That's why I'm not going to lie. It'd be hard for me to support black businesses. Why? Because they overcharge on everything. They overcharge on everything. They, they, they go ahead and make a clothing line, but charging $50, $60 for, for a T-shirt. Who finna buy $50, who finna buy, who finna buy a $50 T-shirt? Not me. I don't care. You're black, white, Hispanic. I don't care. I don't care. The t-shirts that I buy be to no more than no more than 30. No more than 30. I got one expensive t-shirt. One. One expensive t-shirt. Everything else, about $30. That's the average price, but $50, $60 for a t-shirt. I don't have I don't even own Gucci. I don't even own Louis. I don't even own Fendi. All on big brand. I don't own that. That's what's that's the point though. Kanye West don't need y'all money. I'm just clearing this up for the trolls because I know it's a lot of trolls in the comments that if Kanye don't need the money, then, then how is he worth $2 billion? He wouldn't be worth $2 billion without our money. But, but look, what I'm saying is, let me let me, let me me explain what I'm saying. Basically, what I'm saying is the people that start the Black Lives Matter organization, they didn't have any money to begin with. So they went ahead and started an organization, organization to steal from black people. Kanye, what, does, what do Kanye look like starting a White Lives Matter organization when the man is already worth $2 billion? He does don't need no more money to steal from white people, black people. He don't need the money. He already getting the money because people buying his shoes, his clothes, all that. The man gonna always be worth what he's worth. So why do he need to start a white lives matter organization to steal millions of dollars from white people? I don't think Kanye would do something like that. I just don't think he would do something like that. I, that's why. I, that's why I was trying to explain. But this is just to clear it up for the trolls. Anyways, finish doing the rest of the video. Let go. The man is worth $2 billion. He don't need y'all money. What do what other money do he need? That was a dumb comment right there to me. That was a stupid comment. I think that's the end of it, too. I think that, yeah, that's the end. So, anyways, man, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, y'all let me know what y'all think about this whole Kanye West, White Lives Matter, this whole Candace Owens, White Lives Matter. Y'all let me know what y'all think about it. And that last comment was really stupidity. Kanye don't need your money, bro. $2 billion. If I had $2 billion, what I need to steal money from other people? Bro? What I need to create? Like, come on now, man. The man got fashion shows and all that. He don't need your money. But anyways, man, y'all let me know um, what y'all think about the situation, bro. Uh, y'all let me know uh, in the comment section below. I love y'all. God bless. Stay blessed. Peace.